Hi there, welcome to Be A Surface Pro. Today's Surface Pro tip is how to read an ebook. Unfortunately, on the Windows 10 platform, there aren't a lot of fantastic options for ebook reading. I used to have a Kindle, and so I bought my books in the past from Amazon. But unfortunately, the Kindle app on Surface is absolutely terrible. It's not optimized for touch, the reading view is terrible, and it's just not up to scratch. So because of that app, I've decided to leave the Amazon platform and go looking for something else. What I found was an e-reader called Kobo, and I've certainly heard of this brand before, but I didn't know a lot about Kobo. But sure enough, they have an app that's available on Windows 10, and it's a very good option for reading eBooks on your Surface. Not only can I buy eBooks from the Kobo store, I can even import existing EPUB books that I have already in my library. One of the things that I really like about having a native Windows 10 app on my Surface is that I can have that screen split in half and I can have OneNote open on the side. Most of the time I read nonfiction and I often want to take notes about what I'm reading. So this allows me to split the screen and write my notes on the right hand side. Now Kobo is just one of the options that are available. There's not a lot unfortunately, but I'll put a link into the description that shows you a collection of apps that support EPUB and e-reading in general. Now, I tried a few other apps before I got to Kobo. I tried Adobe Digital Editions, believe it or not. Now, this is a shocker. This one, I reckon, comes from the 1990s. It actually tried to install Norton Antivirus on my computer when I downloaded this program from Adobe. So I'd recommend steering well clear of this one for your Surface. I also tried Google Playbooks. Now, Google don't have an app for the Surface or for Windows 10, but you can read books through your browser through Google Playbooks. So that might be a potential option. I had difficulty though in being able to download the books and read them offline. A lot of books on Google Play do allow you to download an EPUB version, so you might even buy something on Google Play Books and be able to read it through the Kobo Reader or one of the other e-reader apps that we'll leave in that link. So you might be a bit more experienced at e-book reading than I am. We'd love to hear about what you read in the comments below. Let us know. Now, if you found this tip helpful, remember to give us the thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more Surface Pro tips. Ready? Ready. And action. Hi there. Failed already. <laughs>